All right, shuttle warm. Spruggy one are done. Bought out of warm coming at you with another list. Transit your spirit. Power y'all by Shimon Shah. First and foremost, as always, I want to start by giving all praises. All praises and glorifications to Yahweh, Ba'asham, Yahweh Shah, Ba'asham, Kaba, Badash, double honors to the apostles, and elders at Great Millstone as well. Peace, love, and salutations to the whole for elect throughout the four corners of the earth. Damn it. This word and truth and sincerity. Shalom, all right? This is going to be a little testimony, a uh, real short testimony in transit. How uh how about she how shot with the miracle for me, man? Yesterday at the laundromat, um doing my uh, laundry. Okay, um yeah, I went up there um all right yesterday, like I said, okay, to wash clothes or whatever, do do laundry, you know, because normally I do it on a Sunday, but um I had uh went out of town <clears throat> to fellowship with brothers. Okay. Uh, Saturday, and we didn't get back to that Sunday night, so I ain't have time to do it. So I had to do it. I had to do it that next morning. All right, uh, which was Monday. I had to do it. It was a Sabbath, but you know, can't be over righteous. <clears throat> I had way too many that need to be washed. So, uh, anyways, I got there. All right, in the spirit. Okay, um, I loaded the clothes up. You know, but I had enough to wash. I had enough coins or whatever to wash, but I didn't have enough to dry. Okay, and I thought I might have uh, enough to dry as well, but it turns out I didn't. The, the, the pocket I had, you know, I was short. The pocket I had the coins in, it seemed like I was short. But the spirit told me, all right, to check deeper, check deeper in uh, my, my backpack or whatever, because that's why I keep my, um, my little laundry money whatever every week all right when i put it away all right spirit told me to <laughs> the chick the chick the other pop at the bottom and it was like uh more coins man there's more quarters and i i, I could have sworn you know that was all the quarters i had <laughs> that was all the quarters i had man i took with me okay because um i was about to go get some um some more money out uh, the ATM or whatever all right but it turns out I had enough all right the most I I don't know uh, uh, I don't remember those coins being in there I can tell you the truth all right but hey <laughs> they were in there man. I had some more coins okay and um I had enough to, I had enough to dry okay after all to dry the clothes after they uh, got their washing so hey man that goes to show you man hey the most I he got our back, man. Okay, how much more when um, Jacob's trouble comes, when the hour of temptation comes, okay? Because the scriptures say, which you can't stress it enough, it's going to be a time like no other, okay? Uh, pursuing the Daniels, the 12th chapter, man, the uh, 12 and 1. Okay, how much more, man, the Most High going to come through, through for us? And all we got to do is believe, all right? What does it say in Hebrews 11 and 6? Without faith, Okay, because faith is going to be the main ingredient. Everything's going to be based on faith. Okay, in these uh, perilous times to come, man. These great miseries that's going to come upon us. Okay? In that uh, time of uh, great temptation. Okay, so great faith is going to be required from the Al Bashmah Shah. But hey, Most High gives us these um, little miracles. All right? These little blessings or whatever. These faith boosters. All right, to keep us in it, to keep fighting, man, to keep believing, hey, to, to boost our faith. Quoted again, uh, Hebrews 11 and 6, without faith, hey, it's impossible to please you. How about Shemiah Shah, man? Okay, so, hey, no, hey, the spirit, man, that was the spirit. The spirit told me to uh, look deeper in my backpack, and I found a, a lot of, uh, lot more quarters, man. All right, which again, man, I'ma mind you, man. I don't remember having no, a lot of those quarters, extra quarters, um, down at the bottom of my pocket, uh, backpack pocket, man. All right, so hey, keep the faith, pocket, man. And like the Lord gonna come through. 
no matter what situation we're in. And that was just, you know, that was my scene, my, my new. But, you know, it's very, um, you know, it, it should be still a uh, uh, great faith booster because at the most I'm going to uh, work more miracles all right, in these days to come, man. For us, man. And we find ourselves in, um, you know, sticky situations, so to speak. You know, um, dire straits. You know, the most I gonna come through for us, man. Okay, hey, the scripture says, um, all right, you shall be hungry, but my servants shall eat. All right, in Isaiah. So, guess what? When that famine comes, you best believe it's gonna work miracles, okay, as far as feeding us, man. Okay, because he fed, he, hey, he fed Elijah, man, with uh, two ravens. He fed uh, Daniel in the lion's den. All right, me and the brothers, my, we always go over that, man, how the, the most I fed. Those are uh, great examples of uh, that scripture I just quoted, all right, uh, about uh, the most I spirit. Okay? So, hey, he always leaves examples. Hey, the scriptures say, um, two, whatever's written the four times written for our learning. Okay, whatever, whatever was written the four times written for our learning. So that includes the scriptures, all right, uh, that boosts our faith, man. That uh, the Most High, you know, He delivered His prophets, or He looked out for His prophets. He worked miracles for His uh, prophets or servants. All right, uh, those scriptures, man, definitely, most definitely. Because we gonna, hey, hey, it's good to uh, read back over um, a lot of those scriptures where the Most High delivered his man, man. Like uh, Shadrach, Meshach, Abednego, aka the Holy Church. Like I said, Daniel, <clears throat> being in the lion's den, he was delivered. All right, um, even in Apocrypha, um, with Dan uh, Habakkuk sent Daniel food. All right, what else? Um, the uh, Isaac, you know, de deliver Isaac from being sacrificed. You know, um, gave Abraham a blessing. You know, he's about to sacrifice um, Isaac. He ended up giving him a blessing, uh, a sacrifice, man. Okay. So those, those are just uh, key examples, man. All right, how the Most High had he delivered his man? Okay, he delivered, uh, he delivered uh, Elijah. Okay, etc. Man, all these, all these great men you read about in the scriptures, men of renown, he delivered. Okay, all right. That's why it says in um, what the apocrypha. As you have um, this roughly paraphrase, I believe, Sirach, the second chapter, you know, has he ever forsook a rhetorical question? Has he ever forsooken his man? And we know the answer to that. No, man. When you read the scriptures, he delivered his men out of every situation. Every, uh, like I said, sticky situation, you know, detrimental situation possible. But guess what? How much more us, when we're doing the work of the Most High, when we're doing the work of the Lord, how much more is he going to deliver us, man? He going to make he going to make a way for his men, man. So all we got to do is keep the faith and believe that that's going to happen. Because if you don't have faith, man, guess what? You're not pleasing the Lord, man. Okay, and a lot of a lot of guys out there they say they have faith. And they really don't have no faith, man. But you know, those kind of men they're going to be found out anyway, man. It's going to be known. And the scriptures say it's going to be known who the Lord has chosen. So everything is going to come out when hey, when times get real hard, that's when that's when it, um, you know, true spirits are going to be revealed anyway. Okay? It's going to be known whether you've been faking the funk, okay, or or, or um you've been sincere in this truth, man. Okay? Because hey, the Lord going to uh, let it be known, man, through adversity, okay? The the adversity that's coming. All right? Um out in this place, man, out in society. Okay, when all hell breaks loose, hey, that's when um Things are gonna be revealed more. Spirits are gonna be revealed more. Whether you've been faking the phone or not, man. Whether you've been full of shit, okay. Excuse my French or not, okay. If a lot of you 
A lot of guys are full of shit, man. I'm just saying. Hey, because you had a posture to heart. You know, he, he, <laughs> he um, pretty much tricked um, you Israelites out there with that one video of um, him supposedly having his foot kissed by Edomites. That was a trick. Okay, <laughs> that was a trick, man. And a lot of Israelites fell for it. And that's just that's an example right there. A lot of you, a lot of you Israelites, man, both men and women, you full of shit, man. You ain't sincere about this. You you want to be entertained, man. This thing is about not about in, being entertained. Okay, we're not out here to entertain you, man. Okay, and play fucking games with you, uh, Israelites out there. You want to be entertained, like uh, Apostle Gabar said, go watch IUIC and these other camps, man. They ain't Sakari, they full of gimmicks. Like, uh, you have uh, what you call wrestling. I, I grew up watching wrestling. They have what you call gimmicks, you know. You know, uh, they they similar to uh, the WWE, which uh, stands for uh, Real Wrestling Entertainment, right? They, they uh, set up the entertain, right? Breads and circuses, right? You got a lot of bread and circus Israelites out there, okay? Like a few I just named, IUIC, Sakari. ISUBK, and they full of gimmicks, man. Watch, watch those cats, man. They'll entertain you because they're not sincere. They ain't about this word. They ain't about teaching you, man. They are warning you, the prophecies, man. Go watch them guys, man. All right. So, so, so you can be full of shit like them, you know? Because those guys ain't they ain't fucking right. And a lot of you guys that take this truth for a joke, that's taking it for a game and entertainment. Okay, want to be entertained? You full of shit, man. And the most thing, hey, your how about smell shot gonna destroy each and every last one of you Israelites out there that's taking this shoe for a goddamn joke, man. Okay, you're just deadly serious, man. Okay? And the most high is only dealing, and we're gonna say it time and time again, man. Like we said time and time again. It's only dealing with the prophets of Great Millstone, the same camps that seem uh and the camps that seem to uh or teach the same like doctrine. Okay, the other camps that teach the same doctrine as Great Millstone, starting with the apostles, they're only dealing with them. And we do have the 100% truth according to the scriptures, man. So we don't care how much you don't like it, hey, it's just the truth. Okay? All right, you ain't gonna find the truth in these other camps. You ain't gonna find sound doctrine, man. And the most only works miracles, you know, with, with those type of brothers and sisters that that subscribe to Sound Dodge, which is under the umbrella of Great Millstone. Okay? You only see us doing videos like this. How to make testimonies and having visions and of great miracles. And most times really dealing with us, man. He ain't dealing with these other camps. You don't see uh, IUIC, you know, doing no test powerful testimony or these other camps like ISUBK and Sakari. Because first and foremost, man, they carnal, man. The, the most I ain't dealing with no carnal Israelites, man. Worldly, they carnal, they worldly. Okay? They, hey, on top of being wicked, man, he ain't dealing with them. So he ain't going to reveal um, no visions and uh, uh, great miracles and, you know, um, um, any events to give them a, a powerful testimony. He ain't gonna let them see chariots and things of that nature, man. Because the most I ain't dealing with them. Point blank, period, man. Okay. So, I'm gonna sign off. Hey, Lord willing, this was edifying and um, uplifting, you know, a faith booster to your brothers and sisters, man. So I reached my destination, man. Yeah, man, keep the faith, man. Because, hey, that, man, I don't know, man. Again, I, can't, I hate, I'm a, keep reiterating this man I, I don't know how those coins showed up you know but i had i had extra coin quarters uh to do my laundry man so i'm gonna sign off man say again all praises and glorifications goes to the howl by shim out shot by shim kakadash okay double honors to the uh, apostles and elders they great millstone well peace love and salutations to a hopeful lake we got the four corners of the earth preaching his word and truth and his sincerity I'm saying Shalom, call me out Shalom, and I'll buy the ball. Shalom.